Hi, YouTube family. Excuse the rough look here. I've had a lazy day at home today with my kids. Um, it is PK Mom Life here, or otherwise known as Tiffany. It's about 5.30 Saturday evening. Um, we have seriously been super lazy all day. Excuse my old t-shirt with bleach marks and everything else on it. Um, I got my stitch fixed today and wanted to go ahead and um, just do the... Um, at least the opening unboxing of it and then tomorrow um hopefully before church i'll try everything on we're up here in my bedroom because the boys are downstairs um playing and hopefully picking up toys but this is how your stitch stitch fix comes and you can get this once a month i think every two or three weeks and then um every other month every season whenever you want um I actually got the style pass. I actually paid for that today. And it's $49 for a whole year. And you get, um, you can pretty much order a box whenever you want. And that $49 you get returned. You know, you get credited back to your account to something you've paid or you buy. So anyhow, um, I went ahead and did that today. And actually, after sending this back, I may go ahead and order another one. So, um, because I like to have a dress for Easter. But, ugh, it's so hard to fit for dresses. It's just hard to tell. So, but anywho, um, Stitch Fix is a subscription box, obviously. Um, you can get clothes in it, bags, shoes. Um, they now are offering, like, intimate stuff, like your panties, bras, bar bralettes, um, shapewear, all that kind of stuff. Um, so in your box, you'll open it, and it looks like this. You've got your mailing bag. Um, it's free shipping and you just put everything in this bag and mail it back that you don't want and then you'll get an envelope like this and it has a couple different things in it this is um, this card here is about the extras you can receive you can get tights bralettes bras underwear socks shapewear and camis um, Honestly, I don't know if I ever get any of this stuff, though. Unless my boobs get a lot smaller. <laughs> this is the price list. We'll look at it afterwards. Although, I kind of have already an idea because I kind of peeked. They have an app that you can put on your phone. And um, after they sent you your box, you can go like to the checkout part of it. And it will tell you. I'll show you guys. Um. Okay, so you see where it says continue checkout? If I clicked that, it would start showing me my items. So I did do that the other day. I'm, I'm not very good at surprises. <laughs> I'm kind of disappointed because I did get another purse and I just got one last month. So anyhow, um, I don't know if this is the same girl or not. I cannot remember. Um, you get the style card. Let me see if I have my last month's stock card. Okay, so I actually have a different stylus today. This time than one I did last time. Last time I had Anne, and this time I have Nicole. So anyhow, um, they always write you a little note, and then the style cards have like suggestions on how you can um, wear each piece they send you. Um, you get five pieces. Um, it says, hello Tiffany, I hope life has been treating you well. I've styled a bright and casual spring expired fix for you today. Although I wasn't able to find a pair of affordable joggers for you at this time, I added the Nateen Lepore Play Leggings for you. These leggings have a gorgeous mix of bright bohemian collars that can work into your choice of top. You can also pair these leggings with a simple monochromatic top to balance these bright leggings. I've added the Paper Moon Top and Andrew Mark Performance Top that you can easily, wear, easily pair with these leggings for a comfy and stylish outfit. 
The paper moon top would all look awesome with these leggings, a pair of white sneakers, and the 41 Hawthorne puffer vest. This is a look you can wear while you were out on adventures with your kiddos. The Moto Lux top tote as a pop of collar to any look. XO Nicole. Um, so I did get another purse. And I got just got one last month. And I don't change purses that often. So I don't, unless I absolutely fall in love with it, I probably won't get it. But this is the purse. You can see it's just it's I mean everything's wrapped up really good. This is, I mean, this is really good size. It's pretty. And these, like, holes on it, you probably can't see my hand, but it is see-through. Oh, it stinks, though. Whew. And then also has this big, like, I don't know what you, I mean, I don't know what you put in this. I guess it's anything you wanted. Like, another, it's, I mean, it's the size of another purse, pretty much, down inside of there. And it's got this real pretty, like, black and tan collar pattern. And then zipper pull is actually, like, rose gold. How pretty is that? Can you guys tell it's rose gold? I think it's rose gold. It's so hard to tell. And then the actual purse. Let's see. It's got the, um solid bottom but it's already been out of shape like I don't think I'll get this um just because I don't need it for one and two like it stinks <laughs> it also has this really pretty um I guess it is rose gold tassel here and on the underside of the tassels it's or not on the underside but on the sides I don't know if you guys can see it it's pink you see that pink it's a popping through right here I think it is cute it's just I don't know I don't need it okay and then here's my bundle of clothes okay so the first top well this is not going to fit <laughs> I can already tell by looking at it it's a paper moon top it's really cute it's kind of got like the scoop neck it's black and white stripes, and it looks like it's probably like a three-quarter length sleeve, roundabout, which on me is going to be long. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe it is a long sleeve. I don't know. It doesn't... Oh, well, that's nice. It's got like a braid detail here on the side. Okay. I don't think if this top fits, which it may now I see this, I don't think I like this only because I'm very self-conscious and um, especially about my admin area, my midsection. Um, and I normally wear shapewear when I'm out. And if I don't have like another like cami or something underneath this, you'll probably be able to see my shapewear. So, but I'll try it on. We'll see. I mean, it's cute. And then... This shirt says life begins after coffee. It's really sh pretty. It's got black lettering here and then afters in gold. It's a nice t-shirt. Um, it's by Mark New York brand. And it's an extra large. I do like this, but I will say this. I'm not really a coffee drinker. I mean, I do like my Monsters, um... Moco Loco or something like that. I can't think what they're called, but they're an energy drink and they just taste like coffee. But I'm not someone that has to have like a cup of coffee every morning. And if I did, it would be like a flavored creamy coffee. But, so this doesn't really fit my personality, I should say. Okay. And then I got this green puffer vest, which I do like. Again, guys, it's March. March 17th, to be exact. And even though this is not real thick, but navy, it looks like it's got a navy inside. It's not real thick. It's still March. You know, I'm not going to be wearing this much longer. And I love the collar. I mean, if I put this on and I really like it, I'll 
you know, I may go ahead and get it. But it's a 41 Hawthorne and it's dark green. Yeah, with this. Keep my mouth shut for a second. <laughs> and then these are the leggings. These are the Net Lepore Play. And they're in a size large. Looks like maybe the orchid, the collar is orchid. Oh, is full length or the crease? I mean, these are cute. I think that might be a tad small. I don't know. I'll try them on. I'm going to go ahead and look at prices because I have a feeling this box is going to be a bust. Which I hate, but it is what it is. Okay. So, the vest. The 41 Hawthorne vest is $68. The t-shirt here is $34. These leggings are $48. This top here is $42. And the um, purse is $58. This is actually my ninth fix. Subtotal is $250. Um, if you get all five, they give you a 25% discount. And it is um, $62.25. And then minus my styling fee, which is $20. The subtotal is 100 or the Final total, if I bought all five, would be $167.50. I just don't think I'm going to get all five. I mean, I, I mean, I can pretty much tell you for a fact I'm not going to get all five. But you know what? I think I'm going to go ahead and try this stuff on for you. The boys are downstairs. They're being pretty good right now. Even though I look a hot mess. I'm trying to be real life with you guys. <laughs> and this is real life. So, um... Yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and try everything on, and I'll be back here in just a minute, okay? I'll see you guys soon. Okay, guys, I'm back. I got my knees, so I'll lift up a little bit. Um, So, I have one right now. The Nanette Lepore Play Ballot Printed Performance Leggings. Um, it says on here, the color is black, and their size is large, and they're $48. And then I have the Paper Moon Keen Cross Detail Knit Top in black, and it's extra large. And it's $42. This top is not quite as bad as what I thought it was going to be. I mean, it's tight. Um, I don't like it because I feel like a prisoner. Here in a minute, guys. Um, but you can see here on the side how you can see, like, the leggings. Okay, and then here are the leggings. Um, you know, I actually don't mind these at all. I may... My phone. Sorry, guys. Let's see if I can exchange these for a bigger size. They're just a tad too tight. See if I can get these. Yeah, I could get these in the extra large. If I get anything, I may get these and just get an extra large in them because they're just, I don't know. I mean, I know leggings are supposed to be tight, but they're just a tad too tight, I feel like. But they're really cute. I mean, they've got this like flower detail down here on the leg, knees down, and this right here and right here, right here with me, is see through. I don't know what you guys think of the leggings. Let me get a little bit closer. I did put my shapewear on just because I feel better. I've really got to start working on losing weight. I keep saying that, but yet I don't do it. Okay. Um, so the outfit actually that she said I could wear together is...
<laughs> she actually said I could wear this top. She said the paper moon top would look awesome with these leggings and a pair of white sneakers and a 41 Hawthorne puffer vest. So let me just put on this puffer vest and show you guys. <laughs> I'm laughing because, like, really? Did you, like, does she even look at what I sent? Or am I just that unstylish guy? <laughs> Yeah, so I'm going to wear this. What do you guys think? I might go to Kroger's and wear this today. <laughs> Sorry, like, maybe this top and the puffer vest, but not this top, the puffer vest, and the leggings. I just, no, no. Not this chick, at least. I'm not comfortable enough in my body and in myself to do that. All right, so let me try on this other top, and I'll be right back. Okay, bye. So this is the, um, Andrew Mark Performance Coco Graphic T-shirt in white. It's extra large and it's 34. I do like this. Excuse my white bra. I do like this. It fits me well. I you can see my shape right now. But it's so thin. I mean, like. It's like no matter what color bra I had on or anything. And I don't drink coffee. So. I don't know. Alright, and here's the bag. I'm going to go ahead and put the, um, this thing on here just kind of give it some substance. Alright. Where I've carried, the tote bag they sent me last time is not a whole lot. I mean, it's probably maybe about this size. I don't know, for some reason this reminds me of like more of a diaper bag shape. And I've carried a diaper bag pretty much for the last five years of my life. I don't want to carry one anymore if I don't have to. <laughs> okay, let's recap. I'm going to stick around and I'll sit here on the bed. Yep. I've got you guys propped up on a TV tray, a picture box, and my jewelry box. I opened the box. Even though my curtains are white, I did open the curtains a little bit. So we could get some, a little bit more natural light in here. There's no curtains left. Guys, you know, I don't think I'm going to keep any of it. This will be the first box I've sent everything back in. And I hate to do that because um, I lose $20. But at the same time, I'm just not in love with any of the stuff in this box. Like, I'm not in love with it at all. So, yeah, this box is definitely a bust. <laughs> I hate that. God, I hate that. But with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and send everything back. Like, I'm going to take it to the post office on Monday. Today is Saturday. And schedule another box to come ASAP and ask them to send me some good stuff, some better stuff, hopefully. And, um, go from there. I mean, ask them to send me maybe something I can wear for Easter. I mean, I don't have to have a dress because, I mean, our, my church is very, very laid back and not fancy at all. But, um, it's, you know, I always do try to, like, at least coordinate with the kids and they have some matching t-shirts, like, polo-type shirts or t-shirt material to wear for Easter Sunday. 
So anyhow, um, I did want to show you guys why I've got you. I don't know if I've mentioned it to you guys before, but I love It's Com It Cosmetics. And um, the other day, QVC had some stuff on there I've been wanting to try, so I thought I'd go ahead and get it. So I got this um, Customer Favorites Collection. And this is what's in it. It has... The Bye Bye Pores Blush, Poreless Finish Airbrush Brightening Blush. And I've noticed, like, I have the pressed powder now, and it's the illuminating pressed powder. And I have noticed, and I don't know if it's just that the lighting at work that makes me notice it or not, but um, when I wear it, the wrinkles right here, like, it really shows off these wrinkles right here. I'd rather not, you know, show off any wrinkles. Oh, that's kind of dark. It's kind of dark. I don't know if it's dark in the picture. But it's sweet cheeks. I guess I could just sparingly put it on. So that's the blush. And then I got, um, also in here is a super size CC Plus Illumination with a SPF 50. Which is this. Color Correcting Illuminating Full Coverage Cream. I got it in light. I'll be there in a minute, buddy. You can come up here if you want. Oh, it's like a pump. I've never seen anything like this before. Look at that. It's a, you know, like a, I don't want to call this, hand cream like type thing, but then it's got a pump on it. I don't have any makeup on right now, so I'll do it over here. It smells good. I'm just kind of rubbing it in. But I mean, if, if you guys notice, I did have some blemishes right here, and you can't see them as much now. Hmm. I'll definitely try that. Well, of course I'm going to try it. I mean, I know the collar will work. And also, they sent the Heavenly Skin CC Skin Perfecting Brush. Um, that says the buff your included CC illumination onto skin using circular motions to a beautiful skin perfecting application. You know, maybe tomorrow when I'm getting ready for church, I will. I'm trying to find the light to find the. Um, but maybe tomorrow when I'm getting ready for church, I'll put all this on. And you guys can tell me how it looks. Tomorrow at church is our open arm Sunday. The church I go to used to be an Episcopalian church. And the neat thing about this church is my honey's parents got married there. That's nice. I mean, it's got like a heavy handle. I mean, it's nice. It says heavenly skin. I don't know if you guys can probably see that or not. There you go. And some bristles. It's really soft. I do like their brushes. It's the ones I've had so far. And then the last thing is the Je ne sais quoi Hydrating Collar Awakening Lip Treatment Serum. Experience our best Je ne sais quoi. Am I saying that right? Lip treatment balm. Now in a serum. Perfect on bare lips or under your favorite lip color. Twist the pen to start the flow of the product and apply directly into lips. Prior to lip control, 
application for a naturally pretty flush of collar. Anti-aging and skin loving, it says. There's a little tab on there. Oops. It's got like four little holes. Can you guys see that? Oh, it's kind of all ran together. Sorry. I got like a vanilla scent. Can you see the holes now? Come. Kind of, it like brightened my lips up. Like they're more pink, I feel like, than what they were before. So, there's all that. So I got all that yesterday. I don't know if it was the other day. I'm just where I've been working. I haven't got it out to really play with it yet. Um, they did also send me a couple samples. There's one more sample on here somewhere. But this one is the Confidence and the Cleanser. Kind of excited to try it. Gentle for all skin types. And there was something else. I thought there was maybe there wasn't. Oh well. Um. So yeah, I think tomorrow morning I'll do a makeup video get ready with me video in the morning while I'm getting ready for church and then just FYI guys I've got a holler box coming I ordered from holler today for the first time and I didn't think about it until after I did it but I should have went through one of your all's links and did not even think about it, so I'm sorry um so I'll have that coming also ordered today and did some shopping today online shopping ordered from Kohl's and I um bought the boys um always put with their Easter basket swimming tracks so I bought them each a matching set of simp swimming tracks and like um a skin guard shirt or whatever they're called like the little shirt thing they can wear with their trunks and um then I got them each a separate pair that are different trunks and then um I got myself two pairs I think of capri jeans and I got a couple pair of tennis shoes too because my work shoes are like gone. Like I need new work shoes so bad. I need new regular day tennis shoes and I need new workout shoes. So I got three pairs of tennis shoes. <laughs> so, oh, and then also, <laughs> I've done a lot of shopping the last two days. Um, Mom let us borrow, if you guys watched the video from earlier, Mom let us borrow her um, blow up mattress last night. So the boys and I could have a movie night downstairs. And the last time we had the movie night downstairs, we moved, I moved Parker's mattress off his bed, which is a full size mattress downstairs. And we slept on it. Um, we kind of slept on it long ways or sideways, I guess is what I should say. And, um, it was like perfect for us to sleep on. Cause before what I got was I'd get like every blanket in the house. I'd peel off my comforter, their comfortable, comfort his comforter off his bed, the extra comforters like we have in storage, every blanket I have, like, you know, blank, couch blanket type thing, and lay them all on top of each other, and we'd lay there on the floor together and watch a movie, and it just was killing my back, and my couch is not very comfortable, so I can't sleep on the couch. I mean, I can, uh, I do, like, I do nap on the couch, but the sleep on my, not gonna happen anymore. So, but anyway, um, so, um, so anyhow, she had let us borrow that blow up mattress last night. And I thought, this is perfect. Oh, I did find the other sample. It's the Bye Bye Under Eye Cream. I need to do another sample. Random. Sorry. But anywho. So last night I went on QVC because I have seen on there before them having a, um, 
I think it's Arabed's the brand, as the day special value. And I've always said, maybe you need to have, you know. And um, went on last night just to see, like, how much they were on there. And it was $88 and was six months payment, six months worth of payments. So I was like, oh, that seems like a pretty good price. I mean, $88 is a lot for an air mattress, but the reviews were good. I knew they were high quality bed, so I went ahead and bought one because it's something that me and the boys like to do. And I haven't done as much with them lately because of the issue of not, I didn't want to carry his mattress downstairs again because it's too heavy for me to be doing by myself. And, um, can't sleep on the floor and I won't sleep on the couch. So it's just too hard. So I haven't been doing it with them and they really, really enjoy it. So I thought I, that's, it's worth the money to me. And I also got me another pair of Vionic flip flops for the summer. Um, I may go back and get another pair like with the next pay, my next paycheck just because, um, I bought the ones I have like two summers ago. And they're starting to get wore out looking, you know. Like, I definitely need another pair of white ones. I ordered, like, the bronze color, which is kind of like a brown this time. Because those are the ones I wear the most. But I think that's... So, I've got a hauler box, a QVC box. And my Trinson should be coming this week, too. I think. I think it's supposed to be here by, like, the 20th or something. So, that's Tuesday. Um... So I do have a couple videos, you know, unboxing type things to come up for you guys. And then um, I'm going to do the boys Easter baskets probably next week with you guys. And Chris, you know, you saw Grinch, everything that goes into Chris's. I'll do all three of my guys. I'll do all four of my guys, I should say. Five of them. Parker, Keenan, Zeb, Dylan, and Chris. All five of my guys. And then, um, so I'll do their Easter baskets once I get their swimsuits in. My kids' swimsuits. I started looking at the calendar thinking. So those are just some things to come up. Tomorrow morning, I'll do a Get Ready With Me video before church. And I'll do all It, all it Cosmetics makeup. Because I do have a lot of It. If you've not tried It and you have bad skin, definitely try it. So, um, yeah. I have their, yeah, I have a lot of their stuff. So I love it. So anyhow, I hope everybody's had a great weekend so far. We have had an awesome weekend. Um, uh, we've been lazy all day. Um, I'm going to get the boys in the bath here soon. We ordered pizza up for dinner. Um, a little bit of a late dinner. Um, I'm going to get the boys in the bath here soon. Get them to bed. Because I purposely did not give them naps today. Because they didn't get to sleep till like 11 last night. And then wake up till like 9.30 this morning. So I purposely did no naps. Sorry. And then, um, tomorrow we got church. Tomorrow at church is what we call our Open Arms Sunday. And it, um, it's where we invite people. I've invited a couple of people. I don't think anybody's coming. You know, it is what it is. And then, um, after church, we, there is a luncheon after church. But I figure we'll come home. The boys are just too wild anymore to try to stay for the luncheons. I mean, and it's so crowded and everything. Um, we'll probably come home and then Chris and his dad are coming over and fixing my upstairs commode <laughs> for me tomorrow. I think that's it. I ha still haven't got to see my honey yet. He came home yesterday from, um, Martinsburg, West Virginia. It's up in the, um, Buntner, D.C. And so it's like six, five, six hours away from here. Haven't got to see him yet because his parents are in this weekend also. They have kept in touch with one of their high school teachers, a high school English teacher, and they're in her 70s. And this teacher was like 94, I want to say. But she, they had kept in touch with her and went to go see her all the time. Every time they come up, they go see her. And she passed away a couple weeks ago, and they're having the services, or they had the services today, I should say. So they were up here this weekend and he hadn't seen him since Christmas. So I was kind of giving him some time with them too. Um, or New Year's, I should say, is the last time he saw them. But I think that's it. Nothing else new going on. Please keep those prayers coming for me and the boys. Um, I figure by the end of the week, it will have been a rough week. With the things that are coming. I don't mean to me. What's the word I want? Um vague but you know I can't I don't want to put everything out there for you guys like and for the world to know um 
I'm gonna say somebody told me they were gonna do something and I told them if they felt like they needed to do it to do it and it's gonna have some repercussions if they did it so but anyhow <laughs> I um just hope everybody's had a great day and a blessed day I really look forward to church tomorrow and um if you haven't watched there's I have a vlog up from like I think two or three Sundays ago maybe three Sundays ago I don't remember I think it was three Sundays ago um and it has some video from our church our church service um of our um of Keenan for one he was dancing and clapping during our songs and then our youth minister shaved his beard he hadn't shaved his beard in almost 20 years so there was that um but we just go to a fun little church I mean the American Baptist Church is just fun very contemporary um contemporary Christian music my minister does not wear a suit and tie unless he's going to wedding, funerals, and divorce hearings. <laughs> he used to just say weddings and funerals. And then when he came to my divorce hearing, he um, wore a suit and tie. So now he has that in. So I think that's it, guys. Um, I love all of you. I'm at 21 subscribers. Oh, my gosh. I didn't even think about that until now to say something. Um, I mean, I've been thinking about it because I was so excited. I mean, people are probably like 20 subscribers. Who cares? I care. I think it's awesome. Um, like guys, you guys do not understand how therapeutic this is for me to just be able to sit and talk like I, um, I don't know, I think the other day maybe I told you guys about how my, um, like if we were in a room or sitting face to face, I may not talk like this to you, but like on here, I can, t I feel like I can talk to you, you know, and it's so therapeutic for me and it helps me get my mind off things and just kind of unwind and vent and I think that's why I like ramble so much but I mean I really want you guys to see what real life is like for me like this is real life this is real life and you know what I show you guys is real life because if it wasn't I would have my makeup on and my hair done and all that and like I've had showers since yesterday I'll be honest so <laughs> Um, yeah, that's it. So anyway, I hope you guys have had a great day and God bless. Um, please give me a big thumbs up if you like this video. Also hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And to everybody that's already subscribed, my 21 subscribers that I already have, thank you so much for subscribing. You do not know how much it means to me. It really means the absolute world to me. I just cannot even explain to you guys. Um, I just can't wait for my, um, channel to grow and my family to grow with YouTube. Um, have a great evening and I'm going to go downstairs and try to see what these boys are doing because they're being quiet. So it's hard. They're either watching TV good or they're into something they shouldn't be. So we will see. I'll see you guys again in the morning with a makeup video. Bye bye and have a good night.